What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Blaze from the Darth Blaze channel, and I got a amazing, amazing haul video. This is probably my biggest haul since I was like a wee lad, and I mean, I'm serious. I got a lot of stuff to go over today with you guys. This is my biggest haul of all time so far. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this greatness. Here we go. Alright guys, so you're going to go ahead and want to watch all the way to the end because at the end I got a special, special, awesome two figures that I'm getting from the homie who picked them up for me, man. He hit me up on a comment on YouTube. Valley559 is the dude, man. He hit me up on a comment on YouTube and was like, hey bro, uh, I'm at our local Walmart and I noticed that they got the new wave of Star Wars Black Series. You want anything? And I was like, yes. Yes, I do. So he's got me a few figures. I got to go down and pick them up, in, I think, tomorrow so. Make sure you guys stick around, man, and check out these. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. We got three boxes, man. Small box, a medium box, and a big box. So let me go set these right over here. We'll get into the small one first, man. We'll get into the small one first. Oh, yeah. Oh, and before this. Um, <clears throat> cheers, everyone. Cheers. <sighs> oh, baby, I see it already. Oh baby. So this is literally what all that's in here to protect this. That's all that is in here. Oh baby, look at that. Greatness, man. The Silver Centurion Iron Man. Greatness, man. Super, super cool about this. And all these figures that you're seeing that I'm gonna show you today. I got at either retail price $19.99 or 20, 30, 40, 50% off uh, on Amazon. So I got them all on retail or below. So I'm super, super excited about this one, man. Yes. Box number two. This is how this one was packed with this and this. Oh man. You guys probably already know what this is. Oh shit, dude. Doctor Doom. Hands down, one of my favorite superhero villains of all time, Doctor Doom, is the fucking man. If you guys can't tell, I got a thing for like dudes in metal suits, so. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alright, let's get into this actually. Oh, there's a piece of tape. There's a piece of tape! Alright. Ooh, that card back though. That retro card back though. Oh my lord. Holy shit! Yes! That is everything I need right there, man. Look at that. Fantastic Four Retro Doctor Doom. Oh, my. I'm, I'm sorry about the glare, but holy crap. Holy crap. And we're saving this, too, by the way. This is all being saved. There's some nice cardboard. There's some nice cardboard. And then, for the last Marvel Legend of the Hall, this is the last Marvel Legend of the Hall. You guys probably already seen it right there. Oh my goodness, man. War Machine, dude. Deluxe figure. Look at that greatness. Oh my 
goodness, man. War Machine is fucking awesome. This is going to be another review I do during February for Black History Month. I really love the sculpt of his face and the 90s style military haircut, dude, and that Iron Man suit. Oh my lord, the War Machine is amazing. It's amazing. Yes. Yes. Oh, and if you guys can't tell, this is a new webcam that I'm using. I got this uh, not too long before I got all these figures, so yeah, new webcam, 1080p, Christmas, baby, the Christmas. Oh my, oh. <laughs> Alright. So that's what, that's all that was in that big box, literally, for protection. But first, the first thing. Going to the Rebel line. I got me a Kanan Jarrus, baby. Let's go. The box is kind of in bad shape, but I'm not really an inbox collector anyway, so that's alright. Uh, that's a cool little pistol. I definitely like the way that looks, and I definitely like the way his lightsaber looks. Very, very cool. Alright, so now this is where we're getting into the crazy shit. This right here is where we're getting into the crazy shit, ladies and gentlemen. Stuff that I didn't think I was even gonna buy until I seen the prices on them. So normally these go for like sixty bucks. The first one, boom, Ray Speeder from Force Awakens, and this thing was forty-seven dollars, and it's normally fifty-nine ninety-nine, so it's twenty percent off. And uh, I had to go and snag it. I had to snag it up, man. I had to snag it up as the figure and the speeder with the speeder stand and stuff so I'm super super excited to get into this and we're gonna break into this like right now on this video by the way and then the other one <laughs> the swoop bike from solo man and infant infant's nest infie's nest dude this thing is dope like it, it just looks insane it looks like look at it oh my lord so we're gonna get into both of these during this video and put them on the wall so that's all there is to it that is all there is to it ladies and gentlemen and so pretty much got this all put together the way it's supposed to go and it's got a peg right here for the stand and I'm just holy moly it's pretty hard actually there we go and then it allows for dynamic poses, I guess. You can see it this way better. Just like, move it however way you want. What did I do? Oh, I knocked off my thingamajiggy. You could also hook in the spear or her staff right there as well. So you hook her staff in right there. I actually really like the detail on this. Um, this moves up and down the handles and then so do these uh, flaps right here, which is actually pretty cool. So she also comes with another accessory other than, I'm going to lose, uh, other than that staff, which is her face mask covering. This is how it looks without the face mask covering, and I know it's not zooming or should be focusing, but it's not for some reason. Supposed to be autofocus. Okay, that looks pretty good like that. Knock on the front. Oh, and she also comes with a backpack. I forgot to mention that. She comes with the backpack. Oop. Alright. Oh, the pedals move too, by the way. And I'm not really... Uh, she has a lot of soft goods on her. And she kind of had to because... She has to sit on a fucking bike. A speeder. 
All right, so this is it in its final little thing, man, and I, I really enjoy it. That's how I'm gonna display it, just like that on the wall. And I did uh, drop her face mask. Oh, here it is. I found it. Don't worry. Boom. So if you guys want to see more close-ups of this, uh, you guys are definitely going to have to check out uh, my Instagram. And it's linked in the description down below, man. This gorgeous, man. Gorgeous. All right. And that is it put together. It's like 21 inches, man. All these little like fins move and this thing moves. These move up and down like pistons. Dude, this thing is absolutely insane. Oh, let's take her out of the package now. All I can say is that soft goods robe and coat slash cape is absolutely insane, man. Don't know why she has black sculpted hair, but that's pretty cool. I love this figure. I love it already. And apparently... Uh, this thing right here, her weapon, her sword spear thing. Apparently it goes somewhere on the bike as well. Like rays, let's see. Yep, right here. That's where it goes. What is up everybody? So we came down to our hometown today. I had to see one of my friends before he leaves and might as well pick up some awesomeness at the homie Valley 559. He hit me up in the comment section, man. This dude was like, hey, do you need the, any of these figures at all? They're here at Walmart right now. They're gonna be gone, do you need any? And I was like, yes, I would love a Moff Gideon and Dark Ray. So that's what we got here, baby. The homie Valley 559, you guys gotta check him out. He is an awesome dude, man. He is awesome. So thank you once again, brother. here in the Walmart NECA section, collectible section, and that's pretty cool. I really like that. Back to the Future 2. That one's dope. And this one's Sports. <laughs> Sport Almanac, man, from Back to the Future. That's really cool. Got some pops. Other than that, nothing. Those are pretty cool. Oh. I used to have that when I was a kid. That is dope. Some transformers. They got Jar Jar. That is really cool. I really, really like the way this Jar Jar looks. I'm not gonna lie. But your boy broke right now. Got a bunch of the 3.75 Anakin. I love that one. Where he slaughtered all the uh, battle droids. Queen Amidala. Yeah, that Anakin where he slaughtered all those uh, Tuscan Raiders. Amazing. Amazing. Then they got the Archive Luke, and the Archive Han Solo, Black Series. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Battle Cat. These are pretty cool. Pokemon. For five bucks. This for 20. I don't know about that one. So well, that's gonna do it for the little bonus, a little hunt here at Walmart. Heading back home and you guys will see the haul. So yeah, catch you guys when I get home. Well, we ran 
into the snow, baby. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're finally back home after the last couple days of getting mail and going down to town, getting a few things from the homies, Valley559. Thank you once again, dude. You are the man for picking those up for me. And uh, yeah, man, we had a crazy drive up. It started snowing while we are driving back up the mountain. It was, it was awesome. So it's been good. It's been good. So let's finally go over everything that we got. And I guess we'll start off with the vehicles, man. I guess we'll start off with the Black Series vehicles. We got Infant's Nest. Infy's Nest, I always pronounce it horrible, but man, oh man, oops, just look at that. Oh, such a beautiful, beautiful figure, man, and it's just going to be sitting over there and it's badass. I love this shit. Also got Ray and her speeder bike which is freaking awesome man and that side right there this uh thing flops down you can see the engine right there and then i think once you take this off and these out you can take this whole thing off and reveal its whole thing and these go forward and out love it and ray looks awesome ray looks awesome man then going over to marvel legends we got Doctor Doom Retro Retro Fantastic Four Doctor Doom and just look at that figure right there Just look at that dude man freaking awesome Awesome figure right here Going to be reviewing that that is for sure and yes These things right here those jetpack things fit in the Mandalorian's jetpack so might be uh, using some stuff from these figures. And then we also got the Silver Centurion Iron Man. This thing right here is dope, man. I can't wait to take some awesome photos with this dude. I love Iron Man. I love Doctor Doom. And I love the next figure that I have not opened yet because it is going to be a Black History Month review figure, baby. We got War Machine. We got War Machine, man. Look at that fucking greatness right there, dude. Deluxe figure with all the awesome little accessories, dude. I I can't wait to get this shit open, man. I just can't wait. Getting into Black Series. Boom. Kanan Jarrus, baby. Or Caleb Doom. I love uh, Kanan Jarrus, man. I really do love Star Wars Rebels. I love everything about the Star Wars Rebel line. I'm glad they made these figures and just another piece to the puzzle. I got a few more to go. I got Chopper, Ezra, and uh, Hera to get and I think my Rebels line is complete, baby. And then these are from the homie Valley 559, the last couple pieces of the pickup, man. Dark Side Ray and Moff Gideon, baby. Look at that dark saber greatness. I can't wait to take this dark saber away from this motherfucker and give it to my Mando up there, man. Give it to Din Djarin up there. I can't wait. <laughs> and then Dark Side Ray, man. Oh boy, I love Dark Side Ray. I love me some Dark Side girls. That's all I gotta say. So that's gonna do it for this uh, toy haul video and bonus little hunt at the end. If you guys enjoyed this, make sure you guys leave a like, comment down below, subscribe to join the Blaze Army if you haven't already. I'm Audi's 5000. Peace, and remember to always stay blazed.